The Unpleasantness at the Bologna Club by Dorothy L. Sayers is a classic example of the detective fiction genre, featuring her famous amateur sleuth Lord Peter Whimsey. Set against the backdrop of post-World War I England, the novel intricately explores themes of honor, duty, and the psychological scars left by the war, wrapped in a complex murder mystery. The story begins with the discovery of the body of General Fentiman at the Bologna Club, a gentleman's club for military officers. The initial assumption is that the general died peacefully in his sleep. However, complications arise when it becomes crucial to establish the exact time of his death due to the inheritance implications involving his sister, Lady Dormer. This leads Lord Peter Whimsey to investigate further, unearthing a web of deceit and hidden motives. One of the striking aspects of Sayer's work is her detailed character development. Lord Peter Whimsey, with his aristocratic charm, intellectual prowess, and nuanced understanding of human nature, stands out as a multifaceted protagonist. His interactions with other characters, such as the meticulous and loyal manservant Bunter and the sharp-witted Inspector Parker, enrich the narrative and provide insights into the social dynamics of the time. Whimsy's character is not just a detective but a war veteran grappling with his own past traumas, which adds a layer of depth to his character and reflects the broader theme of post-war disillusionment. Sayers excels in creating an atmospheric setting that vividly brings to life the Bologna Club and its members. The club, with its stuffy, old-world charm, serves as a microcosm of the societal shifts occurring in England during the interwar period. Through her sharp, often satirical prose, Sayers critiques the rigidity and pretensions of the British upper class. The Bologna Club, with its rules and traditions, becomes a symbol of a bygone era struggling to maintain relevance in a rapidly changing world. The novel's plot is a testament to Sayer's skill in crafting a tightly woven mystery. The initial puzzle of General Fentiman's death is compounded by the discovery that he was poisoned. Sayers cleverly misleads readers with red herrings and false leads, maintaining suspense and engagement. The resolution, when it comes, is both surprising and satisfying, revealing a carefully constructed narrative where every detail has significance. Beyond the murder mystery, Sayers explores deeper themes of loyalty, familial duty, and the impact of war. General Fentiman's relationship with his grandson, George, who is also a war veteran, highlights the generational differences in dealing with trauma and societal expectations. George's struggles with shell shock and his strained marriage illustrate the personal toll of war, contrasting with the stoic demeanor of his grandfather's generation. This intergenerational conflict underscores the novel's exploration of how individuals and society cope with the aftermath of conflict. Sayers also delves into the moral complexities of her characters. The suspects in General Fentiman's murder are not stereotypical villains but individuals with plausible motives grounded in desperation, greed, or a misguided sense of duty. This nuanced portrayal challenges readers to consider the shades of grey in human behavior and the ethical dilemmas faced by the characters. The unpleasantness at the Bologna Club is not merely a detective story but a rich, layered narrative that offers a keen observation of the social and psychological undercurrents of its time. Sayer's ability to blend a compelling mystery with profound thematic explorations sets the novel apart within the detective fiction genre. Her intricate plotting, well-drawn characters, and insightful commentary on post-war society make this book a significant and enduring work in her literary canon. Through Lord Peter Whimsey's investigations, Sayers invites readers to ponder the complexities of human nature and the often uncomfortable truths hidden beneath the surface of respectable society.